Peggy 12. Hello everyone, I'm Megan Marie, Senior Community Manager here at Crystal Dynamics. The team at Crystal D hopes you've been enjoying our newest adventure, Lara Croft and the Temple of Osiris, playing either solo or with friends. In our third developer diary, we're going to give you an inside look at Temple of Osiris' downloadable content and community challenges. On January 14th, the Icy Death Pack launches, which contains a new tomb filled with challenging puzzles and a slew of enemies. The pack also includes new weapons, rings, amulets, and a skin for Lara, which is going to look familiar for fans of Tomb Raider 2013. So when we began development on Temple of Osiris, we wanted to create an in-game system that would keep fans and community challenged well after launch. The team came up with a system to reward the community for completing certain challenges, such as exterminating scarabs with flamethrowers, gunning down enemies with a chain gun, and beating the final boss a set amount of times. Pun intended. Completing these events unlocks goodies and new areas containing challenges in the overworld. If you want to keep up to date with the latest challenges, follow us on Facebook or Tumblr for weekly updates. We have loads more community challenges and content planned. Keep an eye out in early February for the next content drop, which is going to include a second new tomb, weapons, rings, amulets, and a skin for Lara that's going to give Tomb Raider fans a trip back down memory lane. We think you'll really like it. Thanks for tuning in. See you online. Download the season pass for access to all downloadable content.